Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is my second day in Pattaya. Today I've checked into Amari Pattaya. It's a beautiful property. The room I'm staying in has a breathtaking view. Just look at it. I can feel as if I'm on the beach right now. So it's just been 15 minutes. After this, I'm going to show you how this room looks and give you a detailed room tour. So right now, it's just been 15 minutes that we have checked in. We're just going to have some tea, relax for a bit. And then we're planning to go to Terminal 21. I think it's a new mall in Pattaya. I'm not that sure. I'm going to check it up and let you know. Yeah, the plan is to have lunch somewhere in Terminal 21. So just going to rest for a bit and then I'm going to take you through my entire day. So let's just get started. Okay guys, so now I'm going to give you a room tour. This is the Grand Ocean Deluxe Room at Amari Patya. This has a beautiful view, so let's just start seeing my room. So as you enter, you see this beautiful view. Just look at it. It has big glasses. So as you keep coming inside, first just focus on the view. It's absolutely beautiful. It's breathtaking. I mean, waking up to this view is just amazing. Okay, so this is the bedroom area. You can just see. There's also a nice, a bit of sea view from this side. I'll just show you. You can see, I think it's another hotel. And you can also see the sea from this side, the corner side. So there's this study table area. And this is the bedroom. So as you lay on the bed, you'll directly see the sea. You'll actually feel as if you're sitting on the beach. It's beautiful. As you see over here, you can see the kettle area. There are some tea bags, there are cups, there are four water bottles. Again, the sofa is also in the car so that when you sit, you can see the sea completely. You'll feel as if you're on the beach. And they've also provided us with these coconut toffees. You can see. The open washroom, so now we'll walk towards the washroom. Just look at the washroom, there's an open bathtub. And you can also enjoy the view while you're inside the bathroom. Look at the bathtub area, it's an open bath area. And the washroom is really, really spacious. Over here, there's a shower area. It has a big shower. And over here is the washroom area. And then the balcony, it's on the 15th floor, so if you're scared of height, I would not suggest you to come over here. But the view from the balcony is also amazing. Just look at it. You can have your evening tea over here and enjoy the view. It's beautiful. So I personally love this room. I'm just going to make a cup of coffee for myself, enjoy this room and then update you with what I do next. Okay, so we're just leaving. This is my outfit for the day. It's a super comfy outfit. And now we're going to Terminal 21. My family's waiting downstairs. I'm super late. I was just getting ready. When you come outside Amari, this is the view. So it's right on the beach. street right now we're just walking towards terminal 21 i love the view the view is just amazing the beach is on our left side and the weather is also really nice it's not very hot or humid so it's a pleasant weather Terminal 21 is at my back, now we're just going to go inside.
nice concept over here. In front of every escalator, there's a name of a different city. So on the ground floor, Paris was written, and there was an Eiffel Tower. You can see. I'm just going upstairs right now. So let's see. Yeah, now uh, you can see at the back it's written Arrival at London. So let's see how they have conceptualized London. As we're going upstairs, now there's arrival at Italy. Arrival at Italy. Oh, see? There are Roman statues over here. On every corner, see? Plaza de Roma, it's written over there. So as we're going to eat something, now we're going on the third floor for departure from Italy. And arrival at Tokyo. See, there's this Japanese, uh, what do you call it? Light lamp or... I think it's a Japanese restaurant only. <laughs> Japanese comic. And our arrival is at San Francisco. Right now we've arrived at San Francisco and basically this is the area where all the restaurants are. So we're just finding a restaurant to dine at and then I'm going to show you where I'm eating and what I'm eating. At my back side there are a lot of cute cafes with very tempting ice creams and drinks are being sold. So after I'm done eating I'm definitely going to get one ice cream or a drink for myself. They look so good. Okay, so we've come to this place called the Hong Kong Noodle. It's on the third floor only. And uh, this is their menu. We don't eat pork, so most of the options are pork-based and duck-based. We've ordered this uh, stewed chicken with oyster sauce over rice. And the second thing we've ordered is this uh, Chinese herbal chicken wing soup, right? This one, right? Yeah, so these are the two things we've ordered for now. rice bowl is really really nice i was just having it it was so yum that i forgot to record so this uh, the ginger you get along with sushi is also a part of this bowl so i'm having it with rice and there are some spring onions chicken and the gravy is also sweet mm. yum and this is the soup It has uh, fried crispy noodles. Mm. It's so 
full of veggies also. We really like the rice bowl, so we ordered one more. So we're having this corn dog at Bomber Dog. So I've taken Big Dog original, and I've taken the cheese flavor along with spicy cheese sauce and cheese sauce. Now we're at this uh, milk tea station, and they told us that this is their best seller. That is uh, Daddy Beer. That is their premium milk tea. So we ordered this. second floor right now and there are a lot of shops there's this market also right in the middle of the mall and they have some really beautiful pieces so i got this really pretty top it costed me 490 baht which is uh, around somewhere between 1200 and 1300 and it's a really nice it has a neck tie a tie also and it's a really nice flowy top i'm going to show it to you later and right now i'm just exploring the second floor there are a lot of really pretty clothes give this we got a pair of glasses right now from this shop, Rakpu, and we also got a few pair of earrings also. Okay, so right now we got uh, two skincare products from Bias Rocher. One is their serum and one is their moisturizer. We also shop for a certain amount, so we also got this pouch complimentary with it as a gift. And this is a French skincare brand, it's a super famous brand. So yeah, got some skincare products from them. got a really nice pair of sandals from this brand so i just came back from terminal 21 and on my way back i got this oolong tea it is a no sugar drink and it's actually surprisingly really nice and um, now i'm just going to tell you a bit about my experience at terminal 21 it's a huge mall and uh, you'll find a lot of variety in that mall we actually shopped a lot in the mall just tell you a brief up about the mall the mall is huge you'll find a lot of variety of everything in the mall on the ground floor there was also a flea market where different varieties of food was also being sold i've captured glimpse when your proper tour of the mall and bits and parts so that you can get how the mall is and what the mall is about and on the third floor there are all the cafes and on the second and first floor you'll find a lot of shops and even on the second floor in the middle of the floor there was a small flea market where a lot of beautiful clothes were being sold even on the third floor where all the cafes are you'll find amazing food options even in the small shops you'll find corn dogs different ice creams different drinks and the drinks were so tempting i had few things over there which i've recorded and uh, even on the third floor where all the cafes are there are a lot of shops so if you're just going for shopping your purpose will be solved if you're going to eat food your purpose will be solved all the mall was really nice i had a great time i actually was there for almost five to six hours and i did not realize the time passed now we are really really tired so we're just gonna rest for some time after that we'll go for dinner somewhere i'll show you where we go obviously and we're just gonna go for a small walk because our legs are paining too much and after that we'll just gonna call it a night
Our food by this beautiful. 